Hi, suspects. Now that I have all this free time, I've been completely wasting it by watching terrible television. So here's a rundown of it all. On Bravo, there's a Real Housewives of New Jersey. And on that show, everyone seems to be named Joe or Joey. So they'll have arguments that are like, Joe, can you believe that Joey is talking to Joe about my Joe, right, Joe? Also on Bravo, there is a show Pregnant in Heels. In one episode, a pregnant woman wants to have an artist paint her naked on a horse as a gift for her husband. Naked on a horse, you say? Okay, that just seems unsanitary. So on TLC, there's a show Strange Sex. Not to be confused with My Strange Addiction, although there are parallels. But on Strange Sex, there was a man who had a 13-inch penis. You can't even use a ruler to measure that. Also on TLC, there's a show Extreme Couponing. And these sisters had baby diapers in their stockpile. Except they didn't have a baby. On Logo, there's a show Pretty Hurts. Okay, and it is painful to watch. The whole show is about C-list celebrities and crazy rich people getting Botox. Seriously, Logo, you need to think your development through a little bit more. The channel We stands for Women's Entertainment, but I think it should stand for Wedding Epidemic because every show on that channel is about weddings. I guess all women love weddings. Speaking of weddings, on Lifetime they have the movie Will and Kate. And all I got out of that movie is that Prince William really likes Africa. He had an African-themed birthday party. He later volunteered in Africa. Finally, at the end, he proposed in Africa. And now, to top off my terrible TV addiction, Wednesday I went to the taping of the Wendy Carlos Williams show. The Carlos is silent. And before the show starts, they have a hype man who's supposed to get the audience all excited and having fun. But as I was walking in, the hype man comes up to me and starts rubbing my head. And this is not like a pat on the head or he accidentally touched it. No. This was like a full-on running the fingers through the hair head massage in the middle of the audience. So I was there with a strange man violating my hair, and all I could think to say was, I see you like my Jufro. Regardless, the taping was a lot of fun. So suspects, my brain has melted and will probably start leaking out of my ears. But don't worry, because when this happens, I'll just put my brain mush in my gyro bowl. This is more entertaining than it should be.